Hmm. What's up with this? What's up with my hair? This part of my hair never grows. Ever. It's just perpetually that length. You guys see that? You see that? It's so weird. I try to hide it. It's not working today. Well, hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do a favorites video. I feel like it's been a really long time since I did favorites. Did I do a December favorites? I don't even know. But it is the end of January and it is time for some favorites. I'm super excited to share some of my favorites this month because there have been a lot of really cool things that I have discovered, some things I've kind of rediscovered and I wanna share with you guys. So let's get into this. So let's start with the planning category. I do have a couple of different items that I wanna talk about, so let's get into this. Um, so the first thing I wanna talk about are these bad boys. These are the Erin Condren sticker sheets. I will be putting links below for you guys. Um, there will be a link below for the Erin Condren website. There's a couple of Erin Condren products I'm going to talk about. If it's your first time ordering through Erin Condren, you click the link, you sign up, create a profile, and then what will happen is Erin Condren will send you an email with a unique coupon code. It could be instantaneous. It could take a up to a day for them to send that to you. What'll happen is they'll give you a coupon code for $10 off your first purchase. And then once your item ships, I will get a $10 credit too, which is how I can bring all of these lovely things to you guys and show you. So let me open up one of them so you guys can see. I love these things and I actually use these in my monthly budget videos. I'll link my Money Talk playlist down below if you guys are interested in watching it. But yeah, I really love using these in my budget. The reason being is just because I want my budget to be pretty or else like I don't want to do it you know what I'm saying guys I'm sure you know what I'm getting at but anyway it has these really pretty stickers on there and they're like they're a matte so you can write on this with a like ballpoint pen but I tend to use my permanent marker on them um, the pens and markers that I use are always linked below for you guys as well under an Amazon link so anyway but I found that the marker works the best and it's really really smooth paper which is really nice and I absolutely love these um, so yeah they're meant to fit the Erin Condren style but you can really use this with any plan or any type of anything for that matter <laughs> love these guys and they come in a variety of different styles there's like this one which is just some pineapples and there's like a seasonal one I don't even think they have this out right now but it'll be I'll probably be back um, in the fall of this year so also speaking of Erin Condren I got these bad boys these are the Erin Condren dual tip markers I really 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 like these guys um, the really nice thing is okay so let me show you the orange one just because to show you a colorful one so there is like the fat tip on one side let's see will it focus yes it'll focus so there's the fat tip on one side and this is called the medium and then there is also a fine point tip on the other also what's really satisfying about it is this like clicks into this very very well it won't focus for me so i'm just gonna do it like this so you can see they actually like marry into each other like perfectly and i love it um sometimes you get pens that are dual tipped and then they like the butts don't fit together. It drives me crazy. Um, if you're a planner person or just a person that just appreciates that stuff, you'll understand what I'm talking about. But these are really cool. Again, these are called the Colorful Dual Tip Markers, and these are really, really nice. Um, I did get these in the, I can't remember what it's called, the Erin Condren Seasonal Surprise Box, which I did order for January. Um, and this is not something I would have purchased for myself. I never ever purchased or received or even used any of the Erin Condren writing utensils, but these are very, very nice and I do really like them. Also, speaking of planner things, I have to shout out my friend Catherine at Coffee Break Planner for these amazing stickers. She actually just sent this, these to me, but this has to be a January favorites because I have literally been drooling over them for days. Um, and I'm super excited to put these into my planner. If you guys know anything about me, I am not really that into sports. Um, it's really no secret but I love NASCAR um, however it's very difficult to find like good you know like race stickers that aren't that don't like take up the full day you know what I mean like there's these big ones and I'm like I just want to note that the actual race is happening um, and then I actually went through my planner 
the other day and wrote out like the entire schedule for NASCAR. Um, I don't have cable, so I just have like regular network television and about half of the races are shown on network television, which I will definitely be watching and the other ones are not, unfortunately. So, which is fine, but I wanna like notate which ones are available for me to watch and which ones aren't. So anyway, but I love these. They're so cool. Um, I love that there's like the racetrack all around so it's kind of like a confined little space. And then the cool thing is, is I feel like even if you put this in your planner, you can always put in like other things. Like I literally do laundry on NASCAR day. Who's texting me? <laughs> I literally do laundry on NASCAR day. That is like my jam. I love getting laundry done and just watching the race in between. Also sometimes doing like meal prep and things like that. So, um, but I love watching NASCAR. It is so much fun. And these are beautiful stickers from Coffee Break Planner. I will leave her link below. I also have a coupon code for you guys for 20% off your entire purchase. If you are interested in purchasing anything through Catherine's shop, just to let you know, they are all matte removable stickers, which are like totally my jam. So make sure to use that code if you check out with her. So now that we're done with the planning category, let's talk about the finance category. So this month I actually joined up with Financial Peace University. That's the Dave, Ram Dave Ramsey, Dave Ramsey sponsored program. Every Friday I have been doing an update. I'm actually filming the update right after this. So you'll be seeing me in the same outfit. Um, but I am gonna be doing a update for my week Four. So I've done four weeks so far and it's a nine week course. Um, I'm really excited about this class. It's really, really fun. Um, I feel like I'm learning a lot, even though I might be a little bit farther along in my journey than some of the other people in my class, but I feel like I'm learning something from them too because it's just a really great refresher and reminder to just keep staying out of debt. And I don't know, I just can't say enough good things about this class. If you have it in your area, make sure to just check out the information if you're interested in like getting out of debt or building wealth or anything like that. It's a really, really cool, different perspective on things. And I will leave the Dave Ramsey website down below so you guys can check out the FPU section, the Financial Peace University section, if you'd like. And then there's a lot more information about how much it costs, um, different areas that have it and things like that. So anyway, this is definitely a favorite for the month. It might be a favorite next month too, but who's counting? Also, my next fashion favorites, I have two. One is really random and the other one isn't so random. Like my first fashion favorite is scarves. Whoa, scarves. Okay, so here's the deal of why I've been loving scarves lately. I have had an office, like my regular day job is so cold in the front offices all the time. It's like boiling hot in the shop space, but if for whatever reason in the office space, it's always freaking cold. So that being said, I have been wearing and rocking a lot of scarves lately. This is a really old one. Um, I think this is from Gap like three or four years ago. So I won't be linking any scarves below, but just in general, I've been like really loving scarves. I love this one. It's like super, super soft. Um, so yeah, I'm actually like on the hunt for some other scarves in the future. So that might pop up in a new video um, if and when I I find some so you never know also my last fashion favorite is from this company called my intent project it's myintent.org. it's what's your word so I actually found this place on Instagram I want to say and um, as for my word of the year I think I talked about this in my goals and resolutions video a few videos back but my goal for the year not my goal my word of the year is called progress so I felt like that was a good word because it shows momentum and moving forward and that I'm always making progress in any area of my life, whether it be personal, professional, YouTube, internet, life, whatever. So progress. So I found this company and they have great jewelry and bracelets and I wear this bracelet every single day since I've gotten it. And I will see if this will focus. I've been having problems with my focuser. As you can see, it says progress. And I got the one that has the black, and then um, I think this one's the brass one, if I'm if I remember right. You can get a silver plated or like this one's a brass plated, which is like a gold. Um, you can get a couple of different colors, as well as the actual like strings are different colors too. I just went with the black because I felt like the black was probably the easiest that would kind of go with everything, so I decided to go with that. 
Also, just to let you guys know, my friend Jody on Life's Organized Chaos just did her favorites video, and I actually got her one as well because her word, or sorry, phrase of the year is be intentional. She's getting really intentional with her money. She's also going through FPU as well. So when we have our Dragon House dates, we always have a really good time talking about FPU. But she actually did her favorites video, and she loved her bracelet so much that she actually put it in there. So I'm gonna link Jody's video below, and if you guys end up subscribing to her, let me know in the comments down below, okay? Okay. She actually just hit seven, I think it was 700 subscribers yesterday, so I'm really, really excited for her channel. Okay, and then my last favorite of the month has to be these. These dried mangoes are amazing. They are from Aldi. I tried the dried mangoes at, I think it was Cub Foods. These are like my local grocery stores. I think I had got one from Cub Foods. I got one from Target. Not the same, not the same, you guys. These are amazing. Um, if I could, I would eat like four of these a day, but it's probably not the best thing for you, even though it is just dried fruit. I haven't even, oh, there we go. I haven't even opened one yet today, but I just opened it now. But, and also, just from like a packaging standpoint, whoever made these is wonderful because the way that these like Ziploc back together, I don't know if you guys can see it. Let's see if it wants to focus. It's like these little tiny teeth that like integrate together. And it's like the most satisfying thing to like, I don't know, like to push it back together. I don't know why the littlest things in life really satisfy me. I don't know why, but the mangoes are so freaking good. I tried a couple of different other things from um, Aldi as well. I'm gonna have a piece because, you know, you have to. Mmm. Freaking mangoes are so good. The brand is called Southern Grove. But they're at Aldi. They're really good. I think these are about three bucks, three twenty nine a package or something like that. So every day when I get home from work, I allow myself to have a few strips of these <laughs> after I get done walking the dog, which the dog is like, he's like right down here. You gonna jump up and get it? Mango's probably not the best for puppies, buddy. He's down here, but he's too short, you guys. You can't see him. Oh, oh. did you guys see that? It's not for you. It's for me. Ha 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 ha. All right, so anyway, that is gonna do it for my favorites video for January 2017. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any questions, feel free to post them down below and I'm gonna get back to as many of you as I possibly can. Also, all the things I talked about will be down below. As many things as I can find, I will link them again with the scarf super old, Aldi, I'll link who what Aldi is, it's a grocery store, but if you don't have one in your area, sorry. Um, but yeah, so everything that I can find, I will link down below in the description box if you are interested. If it's your first time here or you're a lurker like I am, feel free to hit that red subscribe button. That just makes sure that you don't miss any of my content. If you enjoy it, if you don't enjoy it, that's okay. Feel free to keep on lurking. Also, if you like favorite videos and want me to keep doing favorite videos, feel free to hit that thumbs up button. Let's me know that you guys like favorite videos and that you want me to keep going with this series. All right, so that is gonna do it for me. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day no matter where you are, and I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye, guys!